the next concept in uh, uh, disk uh, uh, mass storage structure is disk management so in previous uh, videos we have learned uh, disk scheduling uh, various uh, algorithms we have learned the next concept is disk management so disk management is all about uh, uh, how you divide your uh, disk into tracks and uh, sectors how you format your hard disk so uh, and uh, if there are any uh, sectors which are uh, not suitable for storing your data how you are trying to identify all those things so such things are coming under disk management okay the first one we will see in disk management is disk formatting so formatting is all about making your disk your disk is a raw uh, uh, storage okay so you want to convert the raw storage into a uh, storage area where you can store your valuable information so to do that one we have to divide our disk into uh, tracks and sectors okay that's what we call it as a formatting we call it as a low level formatting okay it is also called as physical formatting so the next uh, thing uh, uh, in uh, disk formatting is about uh, adding uh, the crc code for your sectors so as we know our uh, track is divided into a lot of sectors every sector will be having a number okay and uh, along with that number it will be having a crc code which is used for identifying whether that sector is uh, corrupted or not corrupted based on the crc code we will going to determine that one okay so that concept we uh, see in the next uh, uh, so, topics of disk management called uh, bad sectors and the karita now to identify the bad sectors we will uh, use the crc codes okay so uh, the that's what uh, is all about disk formatting so second in disk management is about boot block so boot uh, indicates loading the operating system that is called as booting and the karita okay and block indicates a certain portion of your disk so if this is a disk hard disk you can able to observe here your hard disk contains certain partitions like this 1 2 3 4 etc like that now there is a certain amount of memory is reserved in your hard disk where so you are trying to store a program called bootstrap program okay so what does a bootstrap program will do antandre it will try to load the operating system okay so usually bootstrap programs are stored in rom read only memory so you cannot able to modify that one correct so uh, it will be as a holding certain amount of storage in your disk okay certain amount of blocks are reserved for the uh, bootstrap program so we call that one as boot uh, boot strap program okay we call it as mbr okay master boot record anta karithanu so master boot record will be containing the information of where exactly the operating system is present and how to load that operating system so such things such information are stored in this particular mbr block so the next one is uh, bad blocks now the bad bad blocks how it nor uh, occurs in your hard disk is whenever you try to uh, uh, write the data so your read write head pointer will be moving correct so due to uneven movement of the read write pointer it results in uh, uh, scratching the surface of the hard disk or due to uh, heavy uh, uh, writing of data onto the disk certain sectors of your uh, uh, disk will be get corrupted surface will be get corrupted okay which results in creation of bad blocks okay so while writing any data to our hard disk so it is uh, the objective of the operating system to identify such bad blocks in our uh, hard disk so that uh, we should not write any useful information to those bad blocks so in our uh, uh, older operating systems like ms dos we had certain commands called format so using this particular command we try to uh, find the bad blocks which are available in the uh, secondary storage like that various operating systems will have uh, various codes for identifying the bad blocks so here is a small example they have taken 
suppose you have you want to access a logical block say 50 and uh, the disk control what it will do disk control will first check whether the block 50 is a bad block or not how it will try to identify that block by checking the crc code okay so if the crc code is uh, modified means that particular sector or a block is corrupted and artha now this information has to be uh, known to the operating system okay you have to tell the operating system through certain commands so that whenever a user try to write the data for during the next time when user try to access the same block number 50 user should be given information that that particular block is a um, bad block okay or corrupted block so that's all about a disk management so these are all the functionalities which the operating system will be performing with respect to um, secondary storage device